Hey there guys. Today we've got a bench made from my good buddy Gil over at Wildabout Sporting Goods. There will be a link down in the description and a promo code. So this is really a small knife. I, gotta, I can't lie. This is way too small for me. I'm just going to throw it out there. But it's pretty cool. I mean, if it was bigger, it would work for me. But I'm sure there are some of you that are going to like and do enjoy smaller knives. So it's three and five eighths inches closed and under seven inches overall, six and five eighths. So it's really kind of tiny. <clears throat> Blade is 2.95. Cutting edge is right about the same. M390 steel. Rather thin blade at 0 0.101. Overall thickness of 0.45, minus a clip, of course, and weighs in at just 2.2 ounces. So it's a tiny guy. It, it, it's a little awkward in my hand just because it's so small. And when I flip it, it, you know, it's kind of weird where I grab. But they did a great job on this, for sure. Typical Benchmade, you know, finish on the blade. Some really nice G10 on the scales. It's typical access lock, lanyard hole. The clip, again, it, it's got the, you know, oval oval headed pan head screws, which kind of is dumb. Not sure why people still do that. Um, but there's enough room between the top of the clip and the screws that it fits in my jeans just fine. I mean, it, it really works well, even though I would prefer that it not be that way. And it runs on phosphor bronze washers, which you can actually see in here. Uh, they did do some skeletonizing of these inner liners. And that's why it comes in at like 2.2 ounces. I mean, it really disappears in your pocket and in your hand. I mean, it's it's super light, guys. Uh, and it'll break in really nice to be a... I don't know if it'll be a drop shutty because it's a light blade, but even just in the time that I've had it, it has loosened up a little bit because these come from Gil, brand new. He's a Benchmade dealer, Hinderer dealer, um, Boker... Medford, CRKT. I mean, he's got a lot of stuff. Uh, and the promo code that I have for uh, you viewers is good for all of that. Anything they've got on their website, you can order from them. So all in all, this is a great knife. I mean, it's just tiny. But for, you know, the ladies out there, it would probably fit in their shallow pockets. Um and for guys in certain uh, locales, there it is next to the Sharpie, just kind of give you some size comparisons. Um, you can't have a three inch knife. It needs to be under three inches. So this could be fit that bill. Here it is next to the Delica. Um, so that's, you know, again, why companies sometimes are making the smaller knives. And I brought out some of my own Benchmades to kind of compare. A lot of people are familiar with the 940. This is the CF1 940-1 in carbon fiber. So you can tell it's much smaller, but in height and thickness, you're very similar. It's just kind of a shrunk down. I'm not even gonna say it's a shrunk down version of the 940, but uh, it is a smaller version of you know that uh here is the um griptilian <laughs> kind of lost my thought there for a second so this is the full-size benchmade griptilian to again give you a size comparison with the valet and this one because of the weight of the blade it really does kind of drop shut and I've had this for four plus year, probably five years now. Um, so it's gotten a lot of use. That was my daily carry for a, quite a while. 
uh, until I really kind of got back into collecting knives. So doesn't get much pocket time now, but that's okay. Uh, so all in all, this is a really cool little knife if you're into the little knives. Okay, so I think they have their their uses. It fits well in the hand, and there's a little bit of a hot spot with the clip, but I think that's really just because I have bigger hands. So somebody with smaller hands, um, this may work out just great for you. So yeah, it's you know it's your typical Benchmade stuff, right? I mean, is there anything to write home about? Eh, you know, it's it's good. So they did a nice job. Uh, and it does come with the box. It comes with a nylon type of, you know, baggie, which is very typical of all Benchmade stuff. So I'm sure you guys are well aware of that. And there you go. So there you have it, guys. The Benchmade Valet. It's model 485 because Benchmade, much like Tucson, gives a number. But they also give a name. Thank God for that. So... If you're interested, check out Gil at Wild About Sporting Goods, and he will hook you up with any of your Benchmade needs or Medfords or Bokers or CRKT or these, you know, hinderers. He can help you out with all of that. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. I greatly appreciate it. I got a box full of Benchmades, some hinderers, a hinderer I didn't even know was made. So I'll just throw that out there, and that'll be coming up here soon, too. All right. Thanks, guys. Have a great day. And we'll see you tomorrow.